What's going on everybody? I have here the Human War Victor Reader stream uh, and uh, welcome to Blend Power. Today we're going to go over uh, some things in the Victor Reader stream you may not know have even existed on the Victor Reader stream or things that you probably have seen but you never really paid much attention to. Okay, so I have here the Victor Reader stream second generation. Uh, looking forward for the new Victor Reader coming out soon. Uh, I'll talk about that toward the end of the video. So. First, let's power the Victory to stream on. Welcome to Victor Reader. Ghost by Piers Anthony. So the first th thing I'm going to show you is if you press the pound where the pound key is supposed to be to the right of zero. Battery powered. Thirty-three percent. Downloads info. Connected to Wi-Fi, not connected to wireless network. It gives you a pure status and what's going on, so... Battery powered, 33%. Downloads info, no downloads. So it gives you a little bit of a statistic saying, um, your battery, if you have any downloads, and the season pound key. Now, the opposite direction to the left of zero should lock your Victor Reader. Volume, 14. Whoops. Locked. There you go, now you can press anything. Now, to unlock it, you just do one, two, three. Unlocked. See, I'm going to lock it. Locked. Unlocked. Very, very simple. Uh, and the reason why you want to lock it is if you have it in your pocket or something, you won't uh, mispress any keys and mess up your book. Um, now, the next one is you hold down one, it'll bring you to the user guide. So it's like the manual of the Victor Reader that's baked in. Enter user guide. Victor Reader Stream User Guide. And you can navigate through it like a book. 1.2.3 right side of the player. On the 1.2.5 bottom edge of the player. In the center of the bottom edge is the micro USB port. Press it again, hold one. Guide. Okay. So. NLS Bard. 21. Books. 10. Alright, so Mike shut Reader. up, Victor Reader. It won't stop talking. Okay, so hold the key one and it'll take you to the user guide. You can do whatever you need to do. It's like a book. Once, you, once you're done, you hold key one again and uh, it will exit user guide. Okay. Uh, now the next thing you want to you wanna know is um, if uh, you're recording something, so I'm going gonna, I'm gonna to do recording. If you don't have an SD card, it'll do this. No SD card. So, Ghost by Piers Anthony. when you get a Victor Reader, make sure you have an SD card. Um, recommend formatting it on your computer before you put it to use. Uh, the next thing is your Victor Reader can play um, Audible books uh, using the Audible Companion. Uh, and uh, I believe you have to have also installed the Victor Reader Companion. If you have both installed, uh, you can actually uh, uh, send out books to your Victor Reader, plug your Victor Reader into your computer, make sure you have both companions, and uh, in the actual Audible companion, you can go ahead and assign books to your Victor Reader, and it is very, 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 very useful because they have all books. Uh, I wish you could download the books directly from the Victor Reader, but you can't, but that's one little thing to note, since uh, Audible uses MP3 format. It works on a Victor Reader. The next thing uh, you note, this is more for the newbies of the Victor Reader Streamline. Uh, if you drop your Victor Reader, it will actually turn off. Especially if you drop it on the like, concrete or something. The battery is very fragile. Um, it's got a little, it's, it's got a little, a, a little uh, latch, and it will fall easily. Uh, if you drop your Victor Reader harshly, it'll it'll fall, uh, and it can break it because the battery has. Uh, the battery is held in by some pins on the bottom, and on the top it's got a little latch, which really doesn't do much, except hold it in. But if you drop your Victor Reader, it can really harm it. Um, so that's that. And now that we're done with the video, uh, and those are the little tidbits that I have for you guys, uh, let's talk about the new Victor Reader that's coming out, because I'm definitely excited for it. The new Victor Reader has 
um, a, a GPS built in uh, from the Tracker Breeze. You remember that? The, the other thing that kind of looked like a Victor Eater, but it was a GPS. Well, now they combined the Victor Eater with the GPS. Uh, and it's got walking directions, it's got all that good stuff. And I can't wait because, you know what? My phone sometimes misleads me. And this thing is awesome. Uh, it always stays up to date and it'll tell you what you need um, to go where. It'll say, oh, uh, you need to hand left here, you need to hand it right. Um, two steps this way, too. It's a little more accurate because uh, it's made for the blind. Uh, once I can get my hands on that Victor Reader, believe me, it's going to be on the channel. Uh, I think it's going to debut next, toward the end of this week. No, the 28th, I believe, is the day. I'm going to be watching it online. I'm going to be seeing if I can, uh, I start school on the 20th, so I don't know if I'm going to be able to do a video on it or not. I'm going to take everything so that if I can, if I have the chance to, I can, I can uh, give you guys a little bit of a update on that. If not, I'll do a video on it the next day, but I'll do a video on that for sure when it comes out. Um, so that's. Little features from the Victor Reader stream that's coming out is the GPS. As far as I know, I got to I got to hold it during the uh, National Federation for the Blind convention. It feels a little bit thicker, but it feels so much better. Like the bezels are a little bit gl glossy. Uh, like the Victor Reader is a little more glossy and shiny, so it's a little more grippy uh, versus this, which is a little bit too slippery. Um, it's it's definitely more feeling more premium. Um, the battery is a lot thicker. Uh, because it's got GPS, so I th you have a uh, way bigger battery. I don't, they did not disclose how much battery capacity it has, so many milliamps hours, but that's alright because we're going to get our hands on it um, when it's launched. Uh, it's probably, these things are usually about 300 and something, so I'm, I'm not surprised if it's going to be 400 to 500 dollars, um, depending on where you get it from. Uh, so. I appreciate you guys staying tuned for this video, um, and those are the little things about the Victory to stream you may not know, and now you know them. Uh, comment, rate, subscribe. You know what to do. I'll see you in the next one.